you wake up and don't want to smile If it takes just a little while Open your eyes, look at the day You'll see things in a different way Don't stop thinking about tomorrow Don't stop, it'll soon be here It'll be here, better than before Yesterday's gone, yesterday's gone Ooh, Don't you look back Don't you look back Hi guys, this is how to play Don't Stop by Fleetwood Mac We've got three easy chords for the majority of it and this is another example of a song with a B7 in it which I know some people kind of struggle with and it doesn't crop up too often but it's such a fundamental open chord and uh, obviously one of my favorite songs from Rumours actually which was an album that I recommended not too long ago let's get you straight in for a close-up and check out this song okay so here are our guitar chords for Don't Stop by Fleetwood Mac we have an E major and then on most chord sheets that you're gonna see including the one that's in the description below you're gonna see it as an A slash E chord which would be an A chord while still having the thickest E string ringing out. However, I think it sounds much more like the original if we play an Asus 2. It just sounds a lot nicer for an acoustic guitar. One, two, three, four. Down, up, up, down, 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 up, up, down. and change down down up up down up changing on that first up and then from there we got the standard open chords um, for two beats for each so E D and A two three four E D A two three four E D A doesn't matter which way you play the A, whichever's more comfortable for you. Three in a line, or using the anchor finger idea of having your first finger down. Everyone's going to sound totally fine. And I'm using this on a strumming pattern that goes one and two and three and four. Or you can do that same one on a down. One, two, and three and four. If you wake up and don't want to smile, if it takes just a little while. If you do the all downs one, it sounds a little bit more rocky. If you do downs and ups, it always sounds a bit more chilled and relaxed and strummy. And that line happens, or that same chord sequence happens three times. So we got first time, if you wake up and don't want to smile. Second line, if it takes just a little while. Third line, open your eyes, look at the day. And then we need a B chord. I'd really recommend a B7 because it's based on this A chord that we're playing now. If you move your A chord up a string and move your first finger back one, put the little finger down, there is our B7 chord. So we got one. That's what all our strings sound like from string five. You could also play a power chord at second fret if that's more what you're used to, or the full B bar chord, but I think the B7 is the best option here, but any other option that you know how to play a B chord, go for it, that's totally fine. So that's on the last one, and that's for two bars. You'll see things in a different way. And then we're straight on to the chorus, but it's exactly these same chords all the way through the song, whether you're on a verse or a chorus, so rock and roll. So we got E, D, A, three times, A, D, A, E, D, A, B7. And that's just going to repeat for the whole song, basically. So if we go back to the, um, go, if we play this through a chorus, 
So let's play that same chord sequence for the chorus now, and I'm just going to strum on the beat, so you'll want to play along to me now. From the E chord, you're going E, D, and A, two strums of each if we're playing on the beat. In, a one, two, three, four. E, D, thinking about tomorrow. E, D, A, be here. E, D, better than before. B7 chord now. Yesterday's gone. Yesterday's gone. E, D, thinking about tomorrow. Don't stop. It'll soon be here, it'll be here better than before B7, yesterday's gone, yesterday's gone E, D, A, don't you love E, D, A, 2, 3, and 4 and E, D, A, and then that B chord at the end, B7 Recap on the B7 chord, middle finger 2nd fret, 5th string, 1st finger 1st fret, 4th uh, string, 3rd finger 2nd fret underneath that, and then your little finger is on the thinnest E string, just there. That's our B7 chord. A bit of a tricky change, but other than that, a fairly straightforward song, great one to have a sing-along to. Make sure you play along to the record. And that's how to play Don't Stop.